This is code.org, and we're going to extend our scene. So if you don't have something like this, you haven't coded it. Right now, it's in the lesson immediately before this. They sometimes move those around, but it should give you some information where to find the original part. So again, right now, it's lesson 10, part 6, I think. We did the original scene. If you're stuck on it, go look for my tutorial. All right, you'll now be updating it. Add a draw loop to your program. You should only have one. Yeah, we're always only going to have one. Use the lasso selector. That's just this thing, right? Click, drag to select the code that will be updated each time and place it inside of the draw loop. All right, so here's draw function. That's what they call the draw loop, or that, that that's what the draw loop is. And then what, what am I going to place in it? All right, add code to your program to update. Use the lasso. Okay, so what I'll need then is what I need to get drawn repeatedly. All right, what I'll need is definitely my draw sprites, but if I only pull my draw sprites in here, my background was a sprite. So there goes my text. So even though I'm not probably going to update my text constantly, I need to pull in everything. If you have a background, you're going to want it at the top. Usually draw sprites goes towards the bottom unless you have stuff that you want to appear over top of a sprite like I do. I want this text to be over ba my background image, my backdrop, which is at the top. All right. So add code to your program so that your sprites X, Y, or sprite rotation properties so they move. Random number. Cool. All right. I'm going to do a different one for each. So let me head over to sprites, and I'm going to do rotation, and I'm going to put this in... Eh, it doesn't have to be above draw sprites, but I'll put above draw sprites. Sure. And what I'll do then is I'm going to do hippo dot rotation is equal to random number. And I'm going to do like I saw in this lesson, negative five to five, maybe. Let's see. <laughs> Yay. Okay. And then my robot for that guy, I'm going to do, uh, what's it say? Okay, I'm going to do Sprite X. So I'll have them... No, let's have them jump. Sprite Y. So I'll put this here, and I'm going to say robot.y math, random number. And, oh, actually, I should use... Oh, it doesn't even give me a plus. Okay, well, what's my robot's default number for Y? It starts at 300. All right, so that's fine. I'm going to say 290, and we'll go to 305 for mine. <laughs> and of course, I can go even taller or higher of a jump. Ah, that's awesome. Cool. And that's my moving scene. <laughs> this is fun stuff. Onward.